Africa, a continent rich in culture, resources, and diversity, yet many of its people face significant financial challenges. Today, we delve into the reasons behind why many Africans struggle to achieve financial success. Centuries of colonial rule have fundamentally reshaped Africa's economic landscape, leaving a lasting impact that continues to influence the continent's financial trajectory. The legacy of colonization is deeply intertwined with Africa's current economic challenges as the exploitation of resources, forced labor practices, and unequal trade relationships have all contributed to the region's economic woes. Moreover, the transition to post-independence governance has presented its own set of challenges. Many newly independent African nations face political instability, corruption, and conflicts that hindered their ability to build strong and sustainable economies. The legacy of colonialism, coupled with these governance challenges, has created a complex web of obstacles that continue to impede Africa's path to financial prosperity. Despite these challenges, Africa has made significant strides in recent years, with many countries experiencing economic growth and development. However, the effects of colonialism and the challenges of post-independence governance continue to linger, highlighting the need for continued efforts to address these issues and create a more equitable and prosperous future for all Africans. Access to quality education and skills development is a fundamental challenge for many Africans, significantly impacting their ability to thrive in today's competitive global economy. Limited educational opportunities, often characterized by inadequate infrastructure, under-resourced schools, and a shortage of qualified teachers, result in a significant portion of the population lacking the necessary skills and knowledge to secure well-paying jobs. This lack of access to quality education leads to a deficiency in marketable skills, leaving many Africans unable to compete effectively in the modern job market. As industries evolve and demand for specialized skills increases, those without adequate education and training find themselves at a significant disadvantage. Furthermore, the mismatch between the skills demanded by employers and those possessed by many Africans exacerbates the issue. This disconnect highlights the urgent need for educational reforms and investments in skills development programs that are tailored to meet the needs of a rapidly evolving global economy. Addressing these challenges requires a multifaceted approach that includes improving access to quality education, enhancing vocational training programs, and fostering partnerships between educational institutions and industries. By investing in education and skills development, African nations can unlock the potential of their people, creating a more prosperous and sustainable future for all. High levels of unemployment and underemployment are significant challenges facing many Africans, intensifying their financial struggles and hindering their ability to achieve financial stability. Limited job opportunities, especially in rural areas, force many individuals to accept low-paying jobs that fail to provide financial security or opportunities for advancement. The lack of job opportunities in rural areas often leads to urban migration as individuals seek better employment prospects. However, this migration can result in overcrowding in urban centers, putting strain on infrastructure and services. Additionally, the informal sector often absorbs a large portion of the workforce, leading to unstable and insecure employment conditions. Furthermore, Underemployment is a prevalent issue with many individuals working fewer hours than they desire or in jobs that do not fully utilize their skills and qualifications. This mismatch between skills and employment opportunities not only undermines individual financial well-being, but also hinders overall economic growth and development. Addressing the challenges of unemployment and underemployment requires a comprehensive approach that includes creating more job opportunities, especially in rural areas, improving access to education and skills development, and promoting entrepreneurship and innovation. By addressing these issues, African nations can create a more inclusive and sustainable economy that provides meaningful employment opportunities for all. Economic inequality and corruption are deeply rooted issues in many African countries, posing significant challenges to achieving sustainable development and financial prosperity for all. The lack of transparency and accountability in governance often leads to the mismanagement of resources, exacerbating the gap between the rich and the poor. Corruption, in its various forms, 
diverts resources away from essential services and infrastructure projects, hindering economic growth and development. It erodes public trust in government institutions and undermines efforts to promote equality and social justice. Moreover, corruption often benefits a small elite, further widening the gap between the wealthy and the impoverished. Economic inequality, fueled by corruption and other factors, creates a vicious cycle of poverty and marginalization. The wealthiest individuals and corporations often have access to preferential treatment and opportunities, while the majority of the population struggles to make ends meet. This unequal distribution of wealth and resources not only undermines social cohesion, but also stifles economic progress. Addressing economic inequality and corruption requires a multifaceted approach that includes strengthening institutions, promoting transparency and accountability, and empowering marginalized communities. By tackling these issues head on, African nations can create a more just and equitable society where all individuals have the opportunity to thrive. Limited access to financial services such as banking and credit poses significant challenges for many Africans, impeding their ability to save, invest, and improve their financial situation. Without access to these services, individuals are often forced to rely on informal and often unreliable financial mechanisms, such as borrowing from friends or family or using informal savings groups. The lack of access to formal financial services not only limits individuals' ability to manage their finances effectively, but also hinders their ability to invest in education, healthcare, and business opportunities. This lack of investment perpetuates the cycle of poverty and hampers economic growth and development. Moreover, limited access to credit means that many Africans are unable to access the funds they need to start or expand businesses, further exacerbating economic inequality and hindering entrepreneurship and innovation. Addressing the issue of limited access to financial services requires a concerted effort from governments, financial institutions, and development partners. By expanding access to banking and credit services, promoting financial literacy, and supporting the growth of inclusive financial systems, African nations can empower individuals and communities to build a more. Secure and prosperous future. Cultural factors significantly influence financial behaviors in many African societies, often emphasizing communalism and resource sharing over individual wealth accumulation. These cultural values, while fostering strong community bonds and social cohesion, can sometimes hinder individuals' ability to build personal wealth. In many African cultures, there is a tradition of communal ownership and collective responsibility for the well-being of all members of the community. This ethos often extends to financial matters, with individuals expected to share their resources with those in need. While this practice is rooted in noble ideals of solidarity and support, it can sometimes discourage individual savings and investment as resources are often shared rather than saved for personal gain. Furthermore, cultural attitudes towards wealth and success can also impact financial behaviors. In some societies, there may be a stigma attached to accumulating wealth, leading individuals to downplay their financial success or avoid pursuing opportunities for financial growth. Addressing these cultural factors requires a nuanced approach that respects and preserves traditional values while also promoting financial independence and empowerment. By encouraging a balance between communal values and individual financial goals, African societies can create a culture that supports both community well-being and individual prosperity. Indeed, the challenges facing many Africans are significant, but there is also a remarkable resilience and determination among the continent's people to overcome them. Through a combination of education, economic empowerment, and good governance, there is hope for a brighter financial future for all Africans. Education plays a crucial role in empowering individuals and communities to break the cycle of poverty. By investing in quality education that is accessible to all, African nations can equip their citizens with the skills and knowledge needed to succeed in today's global economy. Economic empowerment is also key to improving financial outcomes for Africans. This includes creating opportunities for entrepreneurship, job creation, and access to financial services. By fostering a supportive environment for economic growth and development, African countries can empower their citizens to achieve financial independence 
and stability. Additionally, good governance is essential for creating an enabling environment for economic growth and development. This includes promoting transparency, accountability, and the rule of law, which are essential for attracting investment, creating jobs, and ensuring that resources are managed responsibly and equitably. By addressing these key areas, African nations can unlock the full potential of their people and build a more prosperous future for all. As we reflect on the financial challenges facing many Africans, let us also remember the resilience and strength of the continent's people. Despite the obstacles they face, Africans continue to demonstrate remarkable resilience and determination to improve their financial circumstances. By addressing these challenges head-on through education, economic empowerment, and good governance, we can create a future where financial success is within reach for all Africans. Together, we can build a more prosperous and inclusive Africa, where every individual has the opportunity to thrive and contribute to the continent's growth and development. Join us in exploring more about Africa's challenges and successes. Subscribe to our channel to stay updated on our journey towards a brighter financial future for all Africans. Let's learn, grow, and thrive together.